गुरु पूर्णिमा एसे एसे ऑन गुरु पूर्णिमा फॉर स्टूडेंट्स एंड चिल्ड्रेन इन इंग्लिश गुरु पूर्णिमा इज अ फेमस इंडियन फेस्टिवल हिंदूज एंड बुद्धिस्ट सेलिब्रेट इट विथ फुल जॉय एंड शेयर अकॉर्डिंग टू दी हिंदू कैलेंडर इट इज सेलिब्रेटेड ऑन द फुल मून ऑफ असार मंथ गुरु पूर्णिमा is a festival of reverence and dedication to the guru this festival is a festival of salute and respect to the guru it is believed that by worshiping the guru on this day his disciples receive the full fruits of the guru's initiation guru has great importance in our life gu means darkness ignorance and ru means light knowledge the guru leads us from the darkness of ignorance to the light of knowledge future life is created by the guru only gurus are respected on the occasion of guru purnima on this occasion special prayers are organized in ashrams honored people include people from the fields of literature music theater painting etc katha kirtan and bhandara are organized in many places on this day there is also a provision to do charity in the name of guru no matter what the era is respect for the guru is always building saint kabir das has also described his glory as a great one from govind in every age the guru has always been revered and will remain the tradition of centuries old guru puja is still alive guru puja has special significance on the day of guru purnima there is no lack of respect for guru among the disciples from dhanacharya arjun's guru dronacharya to master blaster sachin tendulkar's guru Ramakant Akrekar Jaiso has maintained the credibility of the guru Maharishi Vedavyas is considered the guru of the whole world as a guru he introduced the world to divine knowledge even today when a student comes first in an examination he gives his guru the first credit it is the guru who recognizes his disciples abilities and makes them efficient it is the guru who gives the right path of life and leads the people on the right track no one can be imagined to be great without a guru it is the wish of every guru that his disciple should get the best and earn the name and fame but the guru never wants the name and fame and wants his disciple to be thriving this is the reason why kabir das has given guru a higher status than god god is imbibed by the guru's teachings today the voice of saint mahatma shows us the path to attain god the world has changed and will change even further but no one has been able to take the place of gurus and no one will be able to take it guru has a special place from gurukul to modern schools even today guruji is addressed to the teacher in the villages time has also come when sarpanchas go for the guru's consent by not taking punch in the decision of towns today in every field there is a guru spiritual education sports literature etc the great men have said that if you want to achieve success then firstly you should find a good guru it is difficult to achieve success without education which is a waste many lines including guru brahma guru vishnu guru devo are enough to describe the glory of the guru but the reality is that guru's glory and grace are infinite 
many forms of a guru loves his disciples. A father, sometimes a brother, a friend becomes a guide of disciples. There is no limit for the guru. It is the biggest dream of a guru to see his disciple high. When the disciple fails, the guru encourages him not to be disappointed and to stand up. It is the guru who makes the country the future of the country. But the work of motivating them to serve the country is in the hands of the gurus. At present, India has the potential to become the world guru again. So its main reason is guru's education. Friends, if you have been a master of the guru, you should express your views and express respect to your guru. However, if we see today's world, corruption, crime and exploitation show us the sad truth that there are no good gurus but only hypocrites.